What up, yo? Lane Killian here. Out here fishing Long Beach with my dad. We're in the glades today. It's prefrontal vibes right now. It's kind of stormy out. Uh, big wind and rain supposed to come in tomorrow. So I uh, thought we'd take this last little chance of decent weather to try to get uh, some fishing in. Uh, see what happens. Check back in with you when we're big. Sandy vibes. It's kind of chomping. It's like little prefrontal kind of thing. It's definitely stormy out. It's not too much wind, but the report said it was going to be windy. It's kind of biting. There's a little ledge situation right here. I'm fishing a, a rocky shoreline. It goes from about five feet down to about 25 and then down to about 30. And that cast, I was on the deeper side of it, so fishing like 30 feet making sure the A-rig's on the bottom, kind of a whine, and then a pause, and that fish ate it on the pause as the rig was fluttering back down, chomping. Oh, dude. Dude, he was swimming at me, bro. It's snow, but these? Dude, that didn't even feel like a bite. Bro, look at that a little greedy boy. He tried to get a few of them. Yeah, that was crazy. Bit on the paws. Thing swam at me. I didn't even feel like I was bit. He chomped it all right. You got the whole deal. He bit. Dude, that's a cool looking Sandy. Decent size. Love that. How he's got underneath his jaw. It's all yellow, kind of square body, almost shaped like a calico. Sick. Oh, dude. And a chomp. Nice fish. Yeah? That or no? No. Dude, another solid one. Fat. A lot of these bass are super fat, like they've been eating. They're so fun. Dude, that was vertical. These are like slightly larger than cookie cutter. They're not like all just dinks. Slightly above the average size. That one's pretty small, but. Wow. I mean, the air rig usually chomps pretty good, but this is like kind of stupid. Next level. It's kind of biting. Right here, dude. That's so fun. Not giant, not tiny. Chewing. Check this out. It's a little air rig set up for the day. It's a Warbits 80H rod. Daiwa Lexa 400 size reel. It's the Warbits A rig. This was a premium blades rig, but I took the two blades off the top and replaced them with heads. So that way I could have five neck breakers with hooks on there, five baits. And that's what's chomping today. Just kind of rolling it right along the ledges, right in the rocks. It's getting bit. Those right there, PK5 swim baits, the five inch swim bait by Kicker Fishing in the baby bass color. Chomping. Up in here. Chomps? Yeah. Help, chomps. It's looking heavy. Stop. 
I got him. Oh, Sandy. Deese. Sandys are still chewing. Little A rig chomp. <laughs> Sick. Like a long one, not super fat. Dang, that's so rad. Sick. Sandy, bro. <laughs> Slow pitch. Schoolies. Dude, that might be the smallest thing you've ever seen. Dude. I think it's the smallest one I've ever seen. That's crazy. Hold on, buddy. Oh, that thing is micro, dude. <laughs> Dad catches big ones. <laughs> Freshy, Bates OG. So sick. Oh, dude. Oh, fighter. Gotta be that color, bro. I, I don't think so. Right skis. Dang, I was right behind you. That's these. Dude. Crushing. All right, we're losing light here. And uh, I don't really have the proper light set up to continue the video. Uh, this light I have now runs off the boat and um, gotta conserve some batteries, but made it this far in the video thank you for watching we appreciate it uh it was super sick got on a good a rig bite stormy conditions not super windy and then finished it off with a pretty good crank bite we're gonna wrap it up here make sure to check out warbits.com you can find me on instagram at lane.killian see you in the next video or see you out on the water